All right, so in this video, we're going to be talking about where Rockstar stole the idea for the arcade from, which is blatantly clear. If you guys have ever seen the movie Tron in or Tron 2, there is a scene in Tron 2 where Flynn's son goes to his arcade and opens it up and stuff like that. There's a whole bunch of, I would say, retro games, and that's basically what we have here at our arcades in the game and then there's a moment of time too where like he turns on some music you notice there's like a room up in the way and that's kind of like what we have here is a little bit of a like an area up there and he discovers the game Tron and then he's gonna go put like a coin inside of it right but he drops the coin on the floor noticing you know that the door has like some sort of thing where you can actually move the machine and then there's a door behind it just like right here you guys seriously it's the same exact thing except we don't have the game tron we have that uh weird other thing right there that just basically opens it up so you guys can see right here in the upper right hand corner he's just discovering now that the machine moves and there's a door behind there there's a whole bunch of computers down here too in which he is going to discover as he walks down a flight of stairs just like we do when we come down here to this area right our planning room to where we're going to be doing a casino heist and or messing with this master computer machine area which he ends up discovering after unlocking a couple other doors uh so on and so forth he finds this room it's got a whole bunch of computer stuff in it which ends up teleporting him into you know the uh well, I don't know what it would be necessarily. I guess it would be the, the internet <laughs> or something like that. But yeah, you guys, I just wanted to go ahead and point this out because this is dead obvious where they literally stole the idea for the arcade from. And, you know, it makes perfect sense because a lot of the things in the game are, they don't come from like, you know, creative people, it seems like. It seems like they're watching movies over at Rockstar Games and all of a sudden they're like, yeah, you know what we should do? We should just go ahead and put this into our game, just like what they've done with, like, you know, the Scramjet, which came from Speed Racer, like, series and movie. I don't know. The Vigilante, which is the Batmobile, which they've stolen from other stuff. Uh, you know, how about a couple other things? So there's some game modes, and there's Tron outfits. You guys know the Deadline series, right? Deadline series, Deadline outfits, and we got those bikes, okay? The Shitaros. Yeah, that's the Tron bike in the, the game that they stole from Tron. So literally, that's where the arcade came from. It's, uh, you know, showing it basically in Tron 2, the movie, which came out well before the arcade, I believe. And that's where, you know, I'm just showing you guys proof of where the actual idea was stolen from, along with almost every single other idea that they implicate into their game you know what I'm saying? But anyways, from there, you guys, if you enjoyed this content and you want to see more, hit that like button to help out the channel, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. But from there, <laughs> we'll just see what movie uh, they're going to steal content from next. Because <laughs> there's a lot of movies that they can be taking some content from, uh, which they have already done. <laughs> so anyways, from there, thanks for watching. My name is Gravesite, and I will see you in the next one. So peace.